everyone, so I'm really excited to be filming today's video because it has been super highly requested. Today's video is going to be an updated sunglasses collection, and even though I did one probably around the same time last year, my collection has really, really grown. And you'll notice a trend in my sunglasses, you guys probably know if you're longtime viewers of mine, which sunglass style is my favorite, but I get so many questions about my sunglasses and about my collection that I wanted to film, you know, a dedicated video. I'm also partnering with a really cool company called Ditto for this video. I actually heard about Ditto last year through a fellow YouTuber named Sarah Bell 93X. I'm sure many of you know her. And I just thought it was the coolest idea because it's basically a sunglasses rental company. But to me, it's so much more than just like a rental company. Now you guys know I have a type. I have a type of sunglasses. I have a type that I feel comfortable with and I'm really, really picky when it comes to sunglasses. I've tried so many different aviators. I've tried plastic frame glasses. I have tried like so many different things. Even I've even purchased different things. And even though I've purchased them, I just haven't loved them as much as my aviators, but sometimes I really want to switch it up. Sometimes I want to, you know, get out of my comfort zone and buy something different, but designer sunglasses are really, really pricey. So I don't want to spend like, you know, four or $500 on a pair of sunglasses that are just going to sit in my like drawer that I keep my sunglasses in. So when the company reached out to me, it just seemed like a really natural fit. And I personally thought that it was just such a brilliant idea that I really wanted to share with you guys. So I know I got a lot of comments from you guys being like, oh, I really want to try aviators, but they're expensive and this company kind of solves all these problems and it's not just Ray-Bans there's so many different brands like Dior, Prada, Westward Leaning, Miu Miu there's just like an unbelievable amount of sunglasses so basically the whole premise of this company is that you're allowed to rent sunglasses you're allowed to keep them for as long as you want for a very very low fee if you're like me and you have a type of sunglasses and you buy a lot of sunglasses that's one thing but if you're the type of person that you just like like trying new things and you want to try different sunglasses this would probably be great for you because you can try so many different sunglasses without you know necessarily necessarily committing to an expensive pair of sunglasses. It starts at $24. You can keep them for as long as you want or you can swap them. And then let's say you just, you know, fall in love with those sunglasses and you want to keep them. You can actually get 15% off the purchase price. You can actually get your first month free. So I will leave the link and coupon code down below. You will definitely notice a type of sunglasses that I like. And if you watch my videos like regularly, you'll definitely already know the type of sunglasses I love. But with a service like this, I thought it would be fun to switch it up and try something new that I probably wouldn't purchase in store. So I decided to try a pair of Prada sunglasses. I will link like these exact ones down below in case you want to rent them, but I kind of like them. I still am very much an aviator girl, but I just thought that this was fun to try. I'm going to be honest, I don't, I have not tried another pair of sunglasses I love as much as aviators. It's just, I just feel like they look the best on me. Unless you're like me and you're in a very committed relationship with aviator sunglasses, I love the idea of being able to date a bunch of different sunglasses or just try out a bunch of different sunglasses without spending a fortune. So I'm gonna leave a link to Ditto in the description box down below. And I believe you can get your first month free. So if there's a specific coupon code, I will put it on the screen here and also in the description box, but you really have nothing to lose. So let me know what pair of sunglasses you wanna try. If you've never even tried aviators before and you wanna try a pair, now is the perfect time. So I have a lot of Ray-Bans. This is basically a Ray-Ban collection video because all my sunglasses, my eyeglasses are Ray-Ban. So I'm just going to go ahead and pick them out randomly, maybe give you a little bit of a story. I will be listing the links and exact style numbers and the sizes in the description box down below. I'm going to zoom you guys in and then do a little bit of a collection. Okay, so the first pair I'm going to show you guys is a pair that I love. I get a lot of compliments on this. This is a pair that started it all for me. This is their original Aviator. If I could only... See, these are what I call my beach pair. I brought these to Punta Cana and I just like, you know, went in the ocean with them. I'm planning on purchasing another pair of these um, that I'm actually gonna like take really good care of, but this is like good to have. It's like my beach pair where I'm not really worried. I can get oil, I can get whatever I want on them. The color of this is called green and gold. It's not green at all, so don't be scared by this, but this is like the just Ray-Ban classic aviators. There's just something about this shape that works so beautifully on people, even better than like the aviators that you'll see at like Forever 21 or anything. There's just something about the Ray-Ban that really flatters the face. So I guess I'll get these out of the way. These are my only pair of non-aviator sunglasses, and they're also by Ray-Ban. <sighs> I don't know why I bought these. I wanted to switch it up. They're not my favorite. Mike wears these a lot. Um, he is the worst. He lost two pairs of Ray-Bans, so... He's been wearing these a lot recently, but these are just the new Wayfarers, and honestly, they're not really my favorite. I just, I like aviators the best. The next pair is my first pair of flash lenses, and these are the blue flash lenses. Uh, like I said in my last video, I actually bought these from my friend, one of my best friends, Nikki. She got them at a really good deal at like TJ Maxx or something. Sometimes you'll be able to find like authentic Ray-Bans at TJ Maxx. So I got these like 
for really, really cheap. Um, they probably wouldn't be the pair that I'd go to the store and purchase, but I'm happy I have them because I do think they are really fun for summer, especially like with this outfit because I kind of have like blue. Like, blue is my favorite color, so I just like the way it looks, especially with my skin and hair color right now. Since we're talking about flash lenses, th this is probably my favorite pair of flash lenses, and it's actually, it was actually a birthday gift from my best friend, Nikki. Nikki surprised me with these. I really wasn't expecting, like, such a generous gift, but they're probably, like, my favorite pair of glasses for the summertime. I just love the way they look. They're super fun. Um, I think they really go really nice with my hair color, and I just love... I just love the pink. So yes, these are my probably one of my top favorite pairs for summer. The next pair I also get a lot of questions about. These are my all black aviators. I really like these. Last a couple summers ago, I wanted a pair of all black aviators, and where did I find these? I think it was like a Beyond the Rack sale. Um, that like I went to the actual warehouse like in Montreal. They had these for like a pretty good price, so I bought them, and I really really love them, especially when I'm wearing like a leather jacket. My sister steals this pair a lot from me. She loves the all black, and I love the all black too. I want to get like a bigger all black pair I think. The next pair is a pair that I get so many questions about. I bought these with one of my good friends Vicky. I had convinced her that she needed a pair of Ray-Ban aviators. At a lot of sunglasses stores you're able to get like a good deal. I know like the store we went to was like buy one get one 50% off and then you're able to like split the bill so it's cheaper for both parties. For me, since this pair was more expensive, I ended up just like paying the base price and no tax, so I saved the tax, which in Quebec the sales tax is 15%, so that's a pretty good amount to save. But these are the silver flash lenses. I have to say this is probably one of my favorite aviators, the silver flash lens. I think that they are just beautiful and they go with everything and they're just so like badass. I really love these. I get so many questions about these. Everyone who like sees them falls in love with them and they're honestly probably my fav one of my pa favorite pairs to wear. I just think they're so cool. Oh, I lied. This was my first pair. They're all beat up. I like sat on them. I still wear them sometimes like by the pool, but they're a little messed up. Um, but these are really nice. They are like a brown ombre. If I had to recommend like a classic pair, I would definitely go with the golden green compared to like this brown ombre. Even though it does go pretty well with me, I like the other ones more on my skin tone. The next pair is my summer pair and also my biggest pair. Oh, but these are a really nice summer pair. They're pretty unique. I've seen a lot more people like with them recently, but when I got them a couple summers ago, a lot of people like didn't have them. Again, I feel like it really goes with my hair and my skin. And I just love like the blue to like clear ombre effect. I like the gold. I just think it all looks really, really nice together. So this is my summer pair. I don't really wear these a lot during the winter just because I, I get the vibe that they're more summery, don't you? So this is why I wear these mostly in the summer. But I have to say, I don't love the size of these. So I might get this pair again like in just like the smaller size because I think the smaller size I just... I'm more used to. And then these are my newest pair. I got them on the way to Punta Cana when Mike and I went in early May. And these are really, really cool. They have kind of like, they're not metal around. They're like a, they're like a plastic tortoise shell. They look kind of retro. If you look, you can't really see, but like when you're looking through it, it's kind of like an amber colored frame. They're just dark brown. And I really love these. I think they're really fun. They're a little bit different than a classic aviator. And if you're like an aviator collector like myself, I think that this is a really fun pair to own. I never really saw this pair at like Sunglass Hut or anything, but I saw it at Duty Free and I had to scoop them up. And I think that's a really fun pair for summer. So I'm happy I have this. So that is pretty much it. That is my sunglasses collection. Like I said, all the links and information will be listed in the down bar down below. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a great day or night depending on when you watch this. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.